That is delicious. Okay, so the secret's out, obviously. Gooseberry Patch Ladies with us again. They have revealed one of their top five picnic recipes. AJ made it. It was confetti coleslaw, right? Yes, yes. So now uh, Vicki Hutchins and Joanne Martin are back with us with the rest of the list. Unfortunately, I just gave away one of them, which we can start <laughs> okay. with. Well, you right? didn't yeah. talk about what let's was just, in it, which is kind of nice. It. It's really it's, refreshing. It's, it's carbonated. so refreshing it is, and carbonated. It is. Just lemon lime soda, mm -hmm. uh, club soda, grenadine, and, some and fresh lemon. lemon slices. Mm -hmm. And you can really make it however you like it. Again, that's the whole twist on it. You could put some really pretty berries in there, just serve it chilled. And mm. as you can see, we put it in mason jars. Would you like some? No, I've already had some okay. things. <laughs> but we put it, you, know, you can serve it in mason jars, you mm -hmm. can do it in pretty wine glasses, you know, whatever to make your picnic special. Yeah, it's yeah. so cute in these. It is. It's it really, is. really it's cute. Fun. Okay, so what do we have next? I think we this have, one, right? Uh huh. Dilly Blue Cheese Potato Salad. <gasps> Of course, everybody loves potato salad, right? Uh-huh. Uh, but this one has blue cheese and fresh dill. Oh, and do you want to taste really them? You're special. looking like you might want to taste a little bit. Of course I want to taste it. Okay. The question is that. You don't have to eat with that. Here, you can use the fork. I shouldn't eat with this? Okay. You can use the fork. But it's got chunky I was just going to try to <laughs> keep nice. blue cheese in it. It's got um, red skin potatoes. Mm -hmm. um, Green onions. But the fresh dill makes it so... I'm trying to Fresh eat my and mint yummy. first. And okay. lemon, too, is in there. A little bit of lemon. Mmm. You know, just a Isn't twist on an old-fashioned favorite. Makes it really special. Oh, my gosh, the blue cheese. It would be great with a burger. It would be fabulous with a burger. You're it absolutely would. right. It okay. <clears throat> and these kinds of things you can make the day before. That's the other thing. They're really and it'll portable. Stay. Yeah, it's and it's almost, almost better, better the day before, yeah. we were saying, with the confetti yeah. coleslaw, that they're better. All the flavors kind of melt together. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. on a scale of one to five so far, how difficult? Obviously, Super I could easy. do this one. Super easy. I could make this even? You know what? The thing is, if you can chop... Mm -hmm. If you can use a knife and cut up some stuff, then you that's, can do it. Yep, absolutely really, really easy. Okay, what about yep. this one? Okay, this is our bursting um, <laughs> with berries, berries bundt cake. cake. Mm -hmm. oh. And again, this is something. It's really moist. It's got lots of fresh berries. It's almost the you consistency of a pound cake, it is. wouldn't you say, Joanne? Yeah. What? And uh, blackberries, blueberries, oh. red raspberries, and butter, of course. Of course. <laughs> yes. So in other words, this stuff is really healthy. Yeah. But it's really nice. It, it's very, uh, you can transport it very easily. It's it's lovely even if you're going to have breakfast. You could slice off slices for breakfast. And you is could, that just powdered sugar on top? Yes. It is, but we were saying you could do a lemon glaze on it. I think that would be know, really good. That would kind of absorb mm -hmm. it a little bit. I think that you know, would be kind of really like a rum good. cake or yeah. something. Yeah. yeah. Would make it nice and moist and it's Definitely. just really beautiful inside and you know, what's easier than that with all the fresh berries in mm -hmm. season? In all of these recipes you get from people that submit them, right? Yes. All so across great. the country. Let's talk about the chicken. <laughs> mm, old I don't know what it tastes like. Old old fashioned fashioned fried <laughs> chicken. Yeah, talk about what this recipe was. It's a little different. Yeah, everybody loves chicken. Mm -hmm. And um, this, this is a recipe that can be hot or cold. Mm -hmm. And, you know, uh, cold for a picnic is perfect. Uh, it's very easy. Probably the, the two things in it that give it the flavor of the thyme and the parsley. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's just basically, and buttermilk. I think yeah. that's another thing that sort of and makes really, it special. And really, it's just as good cold. I think when mm -hmm. it's hot, everybody loves it too, but there's nothing wrong with cold pizza Should we? Chicken. Should Absolutely. I tell everyone what happened in the commercial break before sure. this? Sure. Yeah. Go ahead. I ate one. Up. I ate one. You can't tell because we rearranged it so it looked like there was nothing missing. <laughs> exactly. But I did. I ate one. And it, you're right. It's great cold. And yeah. it's perfect for a picnic. Yeah. yeah. It is. We're at time. Okay. Thank you guys so much for coming in. Tell you're people welcome. how they can submit stuff to your recipes. They or can, to your books, I'm sorry. They can uh, submit online mm -hmm. anytime. Um, Go to our website mm -hmm. at gooseberrypatch.com. And we love recipes, and if we publish their recipes, they'll get a free cookbook. And we do have thousands Ooh. of recipes on our website. And you're always looking for more. Mm -hmm. always. Always, always. Always. All right. <laughs> we have all of these awesome recipes on our website as well. Go to myfox28columbus.com and click on recipes. The Gooseberry Patch Ladies, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thanks for having to us. eat more. Amy, save us some, please. Oh, there is so much we food did. over here. Even I couldn't <laughs> eat it all. <laughs>